You think I don't miss Lainey? But I can't ever say that because I'm supposed to be the strong one for this family, who's never allowed to feel sad. And that makes it hurt even worse. Well, the Goldbergs will start season 10 with more hurt as Jeff Garland's character Murray will be killed off screen months before the new season takes place. So while the show featured some very powerful grieving at the beginning of season 9 as Pops passed away because George Siegel passed away in real life, co-showrunner Alex Barno says of the latest Goldberg death, this is going to be a family that has not reconciled the fact that their father's gone, but has sort of moved on and has dealt with a lot of that. It's an opportunity for this interesting emotional basis for the way people are behaving. Killing the character is actually going to be way easier on the cast and writers of the show. After Jeff left mid-season 9, after complaints of his conduct on set, they had to use body doubles and CGI and just very weird tactics to try to keep Murray involved in the family proceedings when Murray was long gone. So bye Murray, and no one is really bothered to tell Jeff about his character's demise. Alex says, I've had a conversation with Jeff and he's aware that he's not being replaced. The truth is, I don't know if he knows what his fate is, but I'm assuming he knows would be the answer to that question. We haven't had a subsequent conversation since the beginning of writing that he would have any specific clarity on that. But despite the gloomy beginning, the show is very optimistic as they enter their 10th season. It honestly feels like a huge reboot for us, so we have tons of momentum rolling into this new season. And yeah, in order to keep the show rolling, what other narrative choice did they have? They certainly couldn't go on with this whole body double situation. Uh, Murray leaves his family? No. No, Murray had to die. But at the same time, are you surprised to hear this news that Murray Goldberg is biting the dust in season 10?